The good shepherd has risen, who laid down his life for his sheep and willingly died for his flock. Alleluia. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. May the grace and peace of God our Father, the love of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. Good morning, everyone. And welcome to this Eucharist as we begin this, continue to begin this third week of the Easter season. As we do so, we're introduced to St. Stephen, who was a deacon in the church. And then we listen to the gospel, of course, of our Lord. As we prepare now to celebrate this Eucharist, let us take a moment in the silence of our hearts to reflect on God's mercy and to ask his forgiveness for our sins. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore I ask, Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us all, forgive us our sins, and one day bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray. Grant, we pray, Almighty God, that putting off our old self with all its ways, we may live as Christ did. For through the healing paschal remedies, you have conformed us to his nature. For he lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Amen. A reading from the Acts of the Apostles. Stephen, filled with great grace and power, was working wonders and signs among the people. Certain members of the so-called synagogue of freedmen, Cyrenians and Alexandrians, and people from Cilicia and Asia came forward and debated with Stephen, but they could not withstand the wisdom and the spirit with which he spoke. Then they instigated some men to say, we have heard him speaking blasphemous words against Moses and God. They stirred up the people, the elders and the scribes, accosted him, seized him, and brought him before the Sanhedrin. They presented false witnesses who testified, this man never stopped saying things against this holy place and the law. For we have heard him claim that this Jesus, the Nazarene, will destroy this place and change the customs that Moses handed down to us. All those who sat in the Sanhedrin looked intently at him and saw that his face was like the face of an angel. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Blessed are they who follow the law of the Lord. Blessed are they who follow the law of the Lord. Though princes meet and talk against me, your servant meditates on your statutes. Yes, your decrees are my delight, they are my counselors. Blessed are those who follow the law of the Lord. I declared my ways and you answered me. Teach me your statutes, make me understand the way of your precepts, 
and I will meditate on your wondrous deeds. Blessed are those who follow the law of the Lord. Remove from me the way of falsehood and favor me with your love. The way of truth I have chosen. I have set your ordinances before me. Blessed are those who follow the law of the Lord. Alleluia. 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 One does not live on bread alone, but on every word that comes forth from the mouth of God. Alleluia. 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 The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. After Jesus had fed the 5,000 men, his disciples saw him walking on the sea. The next day, the crowd that remained across the sea saw that there had been only one boat there and that Jesus had not gone alone with his disciples in the boat, but only his disciples had left. Other boats came from Tiberias, near the place where he had eaten the bread. Then when the Lord gave thanks, when the crowd saw that neither Jesus nor his disciples were there, they themselves got into boats and came to Capernaum looking for Jesus. And when they found him across the sea, they said to him, Rabbi, when did you get here? Jesus answered them and said, Amen, amen, I say to you, you are looking for me not because you saw signs, but because you ate the loaves that were filled. Do not work for food that perishes, but for the food that endures to eternal life which the Son of Man will give you. For on him the Father, God, has set his seal. So they said to him, What can we do to accomplish the works of God? Jesus answered and said to them, This is the work of God, that you believe in the one he sent. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Today in our first reading, we are introduced to Stephen, who is one of the first seven deacons who are ordained for the service of the church in its infancy. Stephen is very important because as we will see tomorrow, because of his proclaiming the Lord Jesus, an official persecution of the church actually began. He was stoned to death, which we'll see tomorrow, and because of that, they, the, the Jews were fired up, as well as the Romans, to persecute all Christians. This was a very important turning point in the early church. It was a time of great suffering, and that suffering continues even to today in special, in particular places in our world. And then in today's gospel, we see how Jesus was met by those whom he had fed in the, in the multiplication of loaves the day before, and he tells them that they looked for him because they wanted to see more signs. They were always looking for a sign, something unique, something miraculous, something that could give them hope. And he knew that they were like sheep without a shepherd, and he understood this, but he still criticized them for not 
seeking what is true, but looking for signs. I remember as a young man, after graduating from college, my whole plan for life was to be in the field of medicine. But as I began to experience life, and as I began to um, be open more and more to God, I had always been religious, but my, rec but my communication with God, my prayer became far more uh, important to me. I became very knowledgeable and aware of the urgings of the Holy Spirit within me to become a priest. And so I asked for a sign. Lord, give me a sign that this is what I should do. It's very much like many young people who are getting married. Lord, is this the person you want me to marry and spend my life with? Or people who are looking at a possible uh, new job after, and knowing what leaving their current job would mean. All of that, we ask God, show me a sign, even choosing a college. Lord, which one should I choose? You help me, show me a sign. People in the time of Jesus were looking for a sign as their ancestors did. In the, in, the, in the Old Testament, as the people were wandering through the desert, they were fed by God who sent manna from heaven. But that manna became um, for them, it, it was all that they were able to eat until they got to the promised land and they began complaining to God. But many of the Jews felt that because God had given them that sign, that food from heaven, that the Messiah, when he came, would also provide manna, bread from heaven. Jesus, in his miracle that we did not hear about, but which today's gospel is taken from, the miracle of the multiplication of loaves, was a sign that he could perform these miracles as the people of Israel were fed in the desert by manna, so too Jesus was feeding his people with the bread from that he had performed uh, the miracle upon, and so the multiplication of loaves. What we are called to do today is, as Jesus said in the last sentence of today's gospel, to believe in the one whom God has sent. If you are listening to this and watching this video, you do believe. Let us ask God to continue to strengthen our belief and put our trust in him also, always. And now let us offer together our prayerful intentions. Let us pray for the church that the freedom we've been given brought by the resurrection may enable us to live with purpose and help others hold on to their faith and trust in God in the midst of this pandemic. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Let us pray for a deepening of our love for the word of God, that people that through reading and praying the scriptures our hearts may be set on fire and our commitment to God may grow, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That all the human family will be liberated by God from the coronavirus pandemic, that God will help us to grow in our awareness of the needs of one another and help us to serve one another, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Let us pray for all who are unemployed, for those who have been laid off or who have lost their benefits, that God will help them to find the resources that they need and open new opportunities to, for them to use their gifts. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. And remembering all of those whom we hold in our hearts, 
all our loved ones who've gone before us in faith, we now place before God those needs that we have brought with us today to Mass. For all of these intentions, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Father in heaven, may the risen Lord breathe on our minds and open our eyes, that we may know him in the breaking of the bread and follow him in his risen life. We ask you this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have this bread to offer, which earth has given and human hands have made. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness we have this wine to offer, the fruit of the vine and the work of human hands. It will become for us our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Pray, sisters and brothers, that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, our Almighty Father. May the Lord receive the sacrifice at your hands, to the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. Amen. May our prayers rise up to you, O Lord, together with the sacrificial offerings here on our altar so that purified by your graciousness, we may be conformed to the mysteries of your mighty love through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation at all times to acclaim you, O Lord, but in this time above all to laud you let more gloriously when Christ our Passover has been sacrificed. He never ceases to offer himself for us, but defends us and ever pleads our cause before you. He is the sacrificial lamb who dies no more, the lamb once slain who lives forever. Therefore, overcome with paschal joy, every land, every people exalts in your praise, and even the heavenly powers with the angelic hosts sing the unending hymn of your glory as they acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord, God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord. You are the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of your Son, 
our Lord Jesus Christ. On the night he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and gave you thanks and praise. He blessed it, broke it, gave it to his disciples and said, Take this, all of you, and eat of it. For this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, Father, when supper was ended, he took the chalice filled with wine. Once more he gave you thanks and praise, then giving the chalice to his disciples, he said, take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant. It will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. Let us now proclaim the mystery of our faith. Save us, Savior of the world, for by your cross and resurrection you have set us free. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Father, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be here in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ we may be brought together in unity by the Holy Spirit. Lord, remember your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis our Pope, Oscar our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our sisters and brothers who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy, welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, and Blessed Joseph, her beloved spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, and with all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life, and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, and with him, and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor are yours forever and ever. Amen. Confident to call upon God as our Father, we now have the courage to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. 
Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and grant us the peace and unity of your kingdom, where you live forever and ever. Amen. May the peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us share that peace with one another. Lamb of God, you take away the sin of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sin of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sin of the world, grant us peace. Behold the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those who are called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed. May the body and blood of Christ bring us all to everlasting life. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to thy protection, implored thy help, or sought thy intercession was ever left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, we fly unto thee, O Virgin of virgins, my mother. To thee we come, before thee we stand, sinful and sorrowful. O Mother of the Word incarnate, despise not our petitions, but in your mercy hear and answer us. Amen. Let us pray. Almighty, ever-living God, who restore us to eternal life in the resurrection of Christ, increase in us, we pray, the fruits of this Paschal Sacrament, and pour into our hearts the strength of this saving food, through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord is with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Mass is ended. Let us go forth in peace. Alleluia, alleluia. Thanks be to God. Alleluia, alleluia. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our defense against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the heavenly host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the other evil spirits who prowl about the world, 
seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. We wish you all have to have a wonderful day and a wonderful week. Please stay tuned for Father Eric will be leading us in uh, an hour of adoration.
We will now begin our Holy Rosary and we pray for the end of the pandemic that is we are experiencing, the end of this uh, crisis of the COVID-19, the coronavirus. And we also pray for the healing of those people who are infected and those people who will be infected by the virus those people who are dying, those people who are gravely ill, but also including the ones who are affected by other causes, not only of the coronavirus. And we pray for all those people who will be undergoing procedures, including An Kwok and the boy um, who will, who is undergoing an operation right now for a hernia. We pray for those who, especially the elderly, those who are sick, those who have underlying conditions. We pray for all the leaders all over the world, including our church leaders, that we may know how to be able to serve the people of God and in a special way here in the, San, in the Diocese of San Jose. We also pray for our government leaders that they will unite their wisdom and knowledge to be able to help the people whom they are serving. All the leaders on all levels of the government all over the world that they will listen to God's plan and God's wisdom and knowledge that they will use all the resources that have been given to them by God we pray for all those people who have grave illnesses cancer diabetes, heart ailments, paralysis, disabilities. We offer this Divine Mercy Prayer, all said rosary, for the protection of all life, from conception until death, and for the protection also now that we are offering this month, or dedicating this month for the end of child abuse, we pray for the frontliners, those who are serving us to be able to continue to fight this battle. Those who work in the medical field, the doctors, the nurses, the staff. We work for those who work in the grocery stores, the people who deliver shipments and mails, those who work in the restaurants. We also pray especially for the poor. We offer this chaplet and rosary for for our poor brothers and sisters that they will be provided for.
and that the Lord will use us as instruments to be able to also reach out to them and to communicate God's love for them. We pray also for the souls of all those people who have passed away, especially those who just passed away recently. Miss Cecile, whom I anointed, the soul of Aga Maningan, Maningon, all those souls who passed away from the COVID-19, especially the, the ones who also who do not have anyone to pray for them, were in purgatory. We pray for those who are suffering right now from the illness, that God will give them the strength and God will lay there his healing hand on them, that they will be cured, most especially the elderly and those who have underlying conditions. And that we will all be able to find a cure to be able to end this pandemic. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, his only Son of our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under the Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there, he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our, fa our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are in most need of your mercy. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine, all praise and all thanksgiving be every moment thine. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The first joyful mystery is the Annunciation. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread 
and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour for our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us in the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are in most need of your mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, O Sacrament Most Holy, O Sacrament Divine, All praise and all thanksgiving be every moment time. My brothers and sisters, for those of you who are, uh, who are joining us, you can include your intentions. You can uh, type them and send it uh, so that we can include it uh, after the rosary and before we begin the Divine Mercy Prayer. Uh, I'll be reading your intention so we can include it uh, in our prayer. The third joyful mystery is the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are in most need of your mercy. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine, all praise and all thanksgiving be every moment time. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The fourth joyful mystery is a presentation of our Lord Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, 
and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour for our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are in most need of your mercy. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine, all praise and all thanksgiving be every moment time. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The fourth mystery that we will be meditating on, we skip the visitation. So we will be praying the visitation of our Blessed Mother to her cousin Elizabeth. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are in most need of your mercy. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine, all praise and all thanks giving be every moment thine. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The fifth joyful mystery is the finding of Jesus in the temple. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, 
Save us from the fires of hell and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are in most need of your mercy. O Sacrament most holy, O Sacrament divine, all praise and all thanks giving the every moment time. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Once again, I invite um, those who are with us, um, watching and joining us in this prayer at the beginning of um, the Divine Mercy Chaplet, before the beginning of the Divine Mercy Chaplet, uh, I'll be reading your intentions, so please feel free to uh, post your intentions uh, so that we can uh, mention it uh, before we start the Divine Mercy Prayer after the Rosary. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry for banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn to the most gracious advocate, who lies her mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, his only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal salvation. Grant we beseech thee, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, may we imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise to the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Regina Celi, Letare, Alleluia, Io, Temeruisti Portare, Alleluia, Resurrexi, Sicutixi, Alleluia, Ora pro nobis Deum, Alleluia. We will now be beginning our Divine Mercy Chaplet. So we pray for the healing of the whole world and also for our community. We pray for those who are sick, those who are dying, those who have already recently passed away, for the soul of Aga Manangan, and for the souls of Alan Pixon and Cynthia Reyes and Cecile Schaefer for the friends and family of Alice and also for her twin sister and the healing of her back pain for all our friends and family including the ones who are in Facebook we also pray for Vanessa Gonzalez. We pray for Rose Sunrise. Also, one of her child for their health protection and their youngest daughter and other family members in San Diego. We pray for all the nurses and doctors also those who are struggling to receive benefits, those who are undocumented workers, that they will also be helped by the government. We pray for all those who are sick. We pray for the successful surgery of An Kwok, the husband of Senora Betsy, 
for our for all our family members, all your children, Mary Ann, Stephen, Donald, and the Holy Spirit to be sent to all of us for the continued recovery of Mrs. Arena's mother, Mrs. Samaniego, and for her cousin's husband, Regulio, who passed away from COVID-19. We also pray for the soul of Wilfredo and Cheryl Ann Nairi. We pray for our intentions that um, that are not mentioned. Lord God, we also ask you to forgive our sins and to accept the forgiveness in our hearts. That we may also forgive others so that we can open ourselves to the blessings and graces that you want to give to us, the gift of forgiveness, the gift of understanding, the gift of patience, and our attachment from sins, may it be removed from us. We thank you for all the blessings that you have given us, for all the blessings and graces that we have received. We thank you for protecting us and sustaining us during this time. We pray for all those people who are being avoided because they are helping to save lives. We also pray for that all people will be will listen to, to our leaders who are asking us to do measures to protect ourselves to stay home, especially that the weather here in California is improving, that we will not forget to take the measures that we have taken. And for the 100 people who passed away here in California, for the 51,000 people who have died here in the US, and for all those 1 million people who were infected by the virus. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour for our death. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, his only Son of our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God the Father. He will come again to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. You die, Jesus, by the source of life, flowed out for souls. And the ocean of mercy opened up for the whole world. O fountain of life, immeasurable divine mercy, cover the whole world and empty yourself out upon us. O blood and water which flowed out from the heart of Jesus as a fountain of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water which flowed out from the heart of Jesus as a fountain of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which flowed out from the heart of Jesus, as a fountain of mercy for us, I trust in you. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, 
in atonement for our sins and the sins of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and the sins of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and the sins of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and the sins of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and the sins of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. 
For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and of the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and of the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and of the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and of the whole world. Jesus, I trust in you. Jesus, I trust in you. Jesus, I trust in you. Saint Faustina, pray for us. Saint John Paul II, pray for us. Saint Ignatius de Loyola, pray for us. Saint Thomas of Aquinas, pray for us. Saint Augustine, pray for us. Saint Therese of Lisieux, pray for us. Saint Therese of Avila, pray for us. Saint John of the Cross, pray for us. Saint Madre Teresa of Calcutta, pray for us. Saint Padre Pio, pray for us. Saint Maximilian Colby, pray for us. Saint Lorenzo Ruiz, pray for us. Saint Pedro Calungsod, pray for us. Saint Michael the Archangel, pray for us. Saint Gabriel, pray for us. Saint Raphael, pray for us. Saint Padre Pio, pray for us. All the angels and saints in heaven, pray for us. Our Lady of Lourdes, pray for us. Our Lady of Fatima, pray for us. Saint John Baptist de La Salle, pray for us. Our Lady of La Naval, pray for us. Our Lady of Antipolo, pray for us. Our Lady of Prague, pray for us. All the souls in purgatory, pray for us. We now pray the prayer that our bishop has asked us to pray at 12.05, so we'll pray it early, to the Holy Virgin of Guadalupe. Holy Virgin of Guadalupe, Queen of the Angels and Mother of the Americas, we fly to you today as your beloved children. We ask you to intercede for us with your son, as you did at the wedding in Cana. Pray for us, loving Mother, and gain for our nation and the world and for all our families and loved ones, the protection of your holy angels, that we may be spared the worst of this illness. For those already afflicted, we ask you to obtain the grace of healing and deliverance. Hear the cries of those who are vulnerable and fearful. Wipe away their tears and help them to trust. In this time of trial and testing, teach us all of us in the church to love one another, and to be patient and kind. Help us to bring the peace of Jesus to our land and to our hearts. We come to you with confidence knowing that you truly are our compassionate mother, health of the sick, and cause of our joy. Shelter us under the mantle of your protection. Keep us in the embrace of your holy ar of your arms. Help us always to keep the love of your Son, Jesus. Amen. Tanto mergo sacramento venere murcher nuvi et anticum documentum no voce dat rituvi prestet fide supplementum sensum defectui genitori genitoque lauset jubilatio salus honor 
virtus coque. Sit et benedictio procedenti abutroque. Comparsit laudatio. Amen. You have given them bread from heaven, having within it all sweetness. Lord Jesus Christ, you gave us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death. May your worship of the sacrament of your body and blood Help us to experience the salvation you want for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Blessed be God, blessed be his holy name, blessed be Jesus Christ through God and through man, blessed be the name of Jesus, blessed be his most sacred heart, blessed be his most precious blood, blessed be Jesus and the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the Paraclete. Blessed be the great Mother of God, Mary Most Holy. Blessed be her holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be God in his angels and in his saints. Holy God, we praise thy name. Lord of all, we bow before thee. All on earth thy scepter claim. All in heaven above adore thee, infinite thy vast domain, everlasting is thy reign, infinite thy vast domain everlasting is thy reign hark the loud 
celestial hymn. Angel choirs above are racing, cherubim and seraphim. In unceasing chorus praising, Fill the heavens with sweet.